Hello, this video will cover exporting references from PubMed, a health sciences database, into Zotero on a Windows device. To start things off, you will need Zotero. If you have not had Zotero set up, be sure to check out the installation and setup video in the link provided in the description. Once you have Zotero set up, you can start at the library homepage to access PubMed with PACES full text access. Going to the databases tab and then P for PubMed. When accessing any database from off campus, you may be asked to sign in. Do so using your PACE portal credentials. Once logged in, enter a search in the search boxes. In this example, it will be for physical therapy and pain management. In the search results, you can select any articles of interest. Alternatively, if you would like to export them as a batch, you can do so as well, although there are limits to how many you can export at any given time. To export the selected results, click on Send To and Citation Manager. The drop down menu will appear with selection and the articles that were selected as the number provided. You can also change this to all results on the page, which by default will be 10, and all results from the search. But there is a limit. So if your search has more than the maximum amount of articles that can be exported, only the first 1,000 will be exported. Once you're done with your selection, create the file. And the file will be downloaded into your downloads folder. You cannot open this file into Zotero, but you can import it into Zotero by opening your Zotero application. And at the top left where it says file, click import. Locate the NDIB file that was just created from PubMed and open the file. You will be asked if you want to place the items from the NDIB file into their own collection, which is Zotero's name for folders. By clicking next, it will place the newest batch of references in their own folder if you have that folder option selected. And there you have it. You have successfully exported reference from PubMed into Zotero for Windows.